a very good morning to you dear children i hope you all are wonderful healthy safe and must have enjoyed your holidays a lot so now back to studies uh, first of all let me introduce myself i am pushpanjali ma'am and i am going to teach you english and today we are going to do a chapter from our course book chapter number 2 there is ice cream in my eyes so everyone is requested to please take out their course book chapter number 2 there is ice cream in my eyes page number 20 fine and you are going to listen to pushpanjali ma'am carefully so that you understand the story in a much better way listen to me carefully no disturbance should be there fine now what is the title of the chapter there is ice cream in my eyes now this title is something you must be thinking how can ice cream go into the eyes so this story is very interesting and we will come to know later who and why was the ice cream in the eyes so now let's start reading fine now enjoy the story in which two bank robbers are caught in a very special way so it is a story of two bank robbers and uh, they were caught in a very special way so we are going to read out the story and we are going to enjoy the story captain smart is a detective now firstly before i continue with the story every child is going to use the first finger uh, and use the first finger for pinpointing the word that i am reading out so that even you understand what is the correct pronunciation of the words and it will increase your vocabulary too okay so now captain smart is a detective she is a clever detective sniffer is her dog he is a bundle of soft white fur so by now we came to know that there are two there are two characters in the story and one is captain smart and she is a detective and what kind of detective is she she is a clever detective and the other character is a dog who is uh, a bundle of soft and white fur and what is the name of the dog sniffer fine so now moving ahead yesterday varun and veena were standing in front of a tea stall you can see that it's a tea stall fine right? and he is varun and she is veena she is captain smart and this dog's name is sniffer fine right? so two more characters are involved in the story now varun and veena so now all in all there are four characters captain smart sniffer varun and veena and where were varun and veena standing they were standing in front of a tea stall they saw a white dog he ran past them his leash was trailing behind him varun stepped on the leash and caught the dog so they were standing at the tea stall and uh, what happened that they saw a white dog who was passing uh, who was running and uh, he was he ran past them so varun caught the lash or uh, lash and caught the dog now captain smart says thank you very much this is my dog sniffer i am captain smart and i am a detective so here captain smart is introducing herself and she say uh, firstly she said thank you to them because uh, varun and veena caught varun caught the dog and she said that this is my dog sniffer i am captain smart and i am a detective varun says wow you are the famous captain smart we are varun and veena and we are twins so varun is very happy to meet captain smart because captain smart was very famous and he was he was knowing that captain smart is a detective right so he introduced uh, both of them varun and veena now we are going to turn the page captain smart says nice to meet you here's my telephone number call me if you need me so captain smart gave her uh, telephone number to the children and asked them to call call her if they need them next morning varun was reading the newspaper now what happened that next morning varun was reading the newspaper veena veena he cried out look at this they ring up captain smart captain 
Veena said. Mr. X is in town. You are going to catch him, aren't you? Can we help you? Now, what happened that next morning when Varun was reading the newspaper, he cried out Veena and Veena because he read something important in that newspaper. And what was that? What was that? Soon they rang, uh, rang up Captain Smart. And Veena asked Captain Smart that uh, Captain, Mr. X is in town. Now by this line we can make out that Mr. X is someone who is not most probably good because even children were knowing about that person. Okay. So Mr. X is in town. You are going to catch him, aren't you? Can we help you? So the children wanted to help Captain Smart in catching Mr. X. Come to Delhi Bank at 11 o'clock tomorrow morning, she said. Mr. X will be there. Now, Captain Smart was having this information that Mr. X will go to Delhi Bank at 11 o'clock tomorrow morning. So, she asked the children also to come there, uh, to come there so that they can help her. Fine. Mr. X is at Delhi Bank. Now, what happened? Next day, in the morning at 11 o'clock, Mr. X went to Delhi Bank. He has a big bag. There are tools in the bag. What were there in the bag? Tools. The tools are for breaking open the safe. Right? So he was carrying a big bag who, and that bag was full of tools. And why, why he was carrying the tools? He was carrying the tools to break open the safe and take out all the money, jewelry and all the precious things that were kept in that bag. Miss Z. His assistant is with him. They are in the bank. So in the bank, there were two robbers, Mr. X and Ms. Z. Ms. Z is Mr. X's uh, assistant. And both of them were at Delhi Bank at 11 o'clock in the morning. And uh, Mr. X was carrying a big bag. And that big bag had tools in, the ba uh, tools in it. And the tools were bought for breaking open the safe. Captain Smart spills thick oil near the gate. Then she fires a pistol in the air. Now what happened that Captain Smart, because she was having the information that uh, Mr. X is in uh, Delhi Bank. So Captain Smart spills thick oil near the gate. So near the entrance gate, she spills some oil and then she fires a pistol. Listening to the sound of the pistol, Mr. X looks around. That's Captain Smart. Let's run. Mr. X and Miss Z are running out of the bank. Now, Mr. X also was aware that Captain Smart is a very clever detective. So, as soon as Mr. X saw Captain Smart, he just cried out that that's Captain Smart and let's run. So, Mr. X and Miss Z are running out of the bank. They started running out of the bank. But what happened? Mr. X, uh, Captain Smart has spilled thick oil near the gate. So, they don't see the oil near the gate and they slip and fall flat on the ground road. Now what happened that when Mr. X and Miss Z were running out of the bank, so they don't see the oil that was there near the gate and they slipped and fall flat on the road. Captain Smart, Varun, Veena, this is your chance. Varun and Veena come running. So now because Captain Smart was inside, uh, uh, was there inside the bank. So he soon, uh, so Captain Smart soon called out Varun and Veena because Varun and Veena wanted to help Captain Smart. So, he, uh, Captain Smart shouted, this is your chance and Varun and Veena came running. They come very close to Mr. X and Miss Z. Varun throws a big brick of ice cream at Mr. X's face. Veena throws another brick of ice cream at Miss Z's face. So, now we can make out why the title of the story is There is Ice Cream in My Eyes. This was the reason that the title was, uh, title was this particular because Varun throws a big brick of ice cream at Mr. X's face and Veena throws another brick of ice cream at Miss Z's face. Mr. X says, run, let's run. Miss Z says, how can I run? I can't see there is ice cream in my eyes. Mr. X says, there is ice cream in my eyes too. Because both of them, they threw that big brick of ice cream at their faces. So the ice cream went in their eyes. And because the, the ice cream went in their eyes, they were not able to see properly. Now, next page. Captain Smart. Sniffer. Charge. Mr. X. Oh, oh. A dog is holding my leg. So, here we can see in the picture that uh, this person is Mr. X and Sniffer is holding his leg. And this is Miss Z. Varun, 
Veena and she is Captain Smart. Two policemen appear. They put handcuffs on Mr. X and Ms. Z. They take them away in the police van. So how many uh, police, uh, policemen appear? Two policemen appear and they handcuffed Mr. X and Ms. Z and they took them away in the police van. Captain Smart says, well done children. Varun and Veena says, and well done. Sniffer, because Sniffer, Varun, Veena, they all played a very important role in catching Mr. X and Miss Z. So this was the story that was there. There is, there is ice cream in my eyes and I hope everyone enjoyed this story. It was a very interesting story. So now Pushpanjali ma'am is requesting all of you to give, uh, give it a reading once again so that you are well aware of the story once again. And soon in our next video, we'll be doing the further exercises. Okay, thank you so much. Bye.